Thank you, Jeff. Now, we're continuing to learn about the events following a series of break-ins in a Norfolk neighborhood. Last night, we told you about how one woman's home was broken into twice in the same week. And now we're learning that she wasn't the only victim. Penny, your side's Michelle Wolf joins us with what else she uncovered tonight, Michelle. Yeah, Tom, when thieves stole from Tammy Villalobos Flores' home on May 1st, they broke into another home that morning on Hemlock Street. A police report filed that day explains how officers spotted the suspects and tracked them to a home on Kendon Avenue. Today, Chopper 10 flew over that home, and this is what we found. A secluded backyard filled with tables, benches, lawn ornaments, and a large structure covered by a tarp surrounded by miscellaneous objects, something investigators listed in their report as a makeshift home containing numerous items, along with a military-grade rocket launcher. As Chopper 10 zoomed in on the property Friday, a woman with a backpack began pulling out blankets from underneath a tarp and began to cover items in the backyard from view, specifically tables and the items on those tables. This is the same house Norfolk police located some of Tamara Villalobos Flores' stolen belongings. After officers noticed them in a vehicle parked in front of the Kennan Avenue property, ultimately towing the vehicle as evidence. At the time the report was filed on May 1st, investigators say the suspects were nowhere to be found. Since then, Tammy Villalobos Flores' home was broken into a second time and more items stolen. I reached out to Norfolk police this morning asking them if any arrests were made and how a rocket launcher made it to that location. I've not heard back. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side. And now we have